Good evening, guys. How are you? How are you? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you? We'll wait a few minutes. Can you hear me? Yes. Wilson, Anna, Patricia, good evening. How are you guys? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. We'll wait a couple of minutes for the other students. Good evening, Gloria. Good Hi, Francisco. Evening, Hi, Herbert. Hi, Daniel. Ah, that's the spirit, Gloria. Love Good your hat. Hi, and your Christmas hat, guys. Francisco, your Christmas hat. Wear it. Good evening. Good, nice decoration. Background, Mario. Nice. Uh huh. Francisco, you're not wearing your reindeer's hat. Mm -hmm. How are you? How are you guys? Tired? I'm tired. Yes, you're tired. Hi. Hi, nice hat, Steve Canales, Mr. Steve Canales. A little bit. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, nice. Uh huh. Somebody else wearing their Christmas hats? Good evening, no? good evening, good evening, good evening. One more minute, we'll wait. Nice hat, Wilson. There you go, Christmas spirits. Mm -hmm. Good. Somebody else, David, you're wearing Francisco, wear your reindeer mm -hmm. hat, wear your reindeer hat. Anna? Saira, no, no. Yes, teacher, present. Uh huh. And your Christmas spirit, where is it? Thanks. Ya, ya voy a poner algo ahí. 
Mm-hmm. Ok, let's see, let's take attendance. Ana María, Ana María Campos. Present teacher. Um, Cristina. Present teacher. Daniel. Present teacher. Edit. Edit. Um, Francisco. Francisco. Present teacher. Yeah. Freddy. Freddy. Um, Gabriela. Present teacher. Gloria. I saw Gloria there. Herbert. Good evening, teacher. Present. I Iris. Iris. Uh, Jacqueline. Jacqueline. Let's see. Jose Santos. Luis. Present, Luis. teacher. Present. Uh, Marco. Sí, present, teacher. Mario. Present, teacher. Um, let's see. Mario. Um, Norma. Present, teacher. Olinda. Mm -hmm. uh, Patricia. Rosa. Rosa Hilda. Rosa Hilda. Rosa. Ok. Uh, Silvia. Silvia. David. Present teacher. Wilson and Saira. Present teacher. Present teacher. Okay, many people are saying. Okay. 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 So how are you this evening, guys? Good? Okay, Jose, you're late or you never answer when I call your name. Jose? Jose? Hello, teacher. If you, if, cuando yo lo llame, diga presente porque si no yo le pongo cero. Okay, teacher. ¿Por qué no, no le escuché, teacher? No le escuché. Mm. <laughs> si no contestan, yo les pongo cero y los, los toman como cero. Ahí ya no, ya no puedo cambiar nada. Okay, so today we're going to start with a little fun guest song. Okay, these are songs from the, uh, let's see, from the 2000, I mean, your time. Let's see, let's see. Um, I have it here. Guess the song, 2010 to 2020, okay? So it's a little game to guess what's the name of the song, okay? Wait, I'm going to put. I'm going to start here. Uh, one minute. Okay, I'm gonna share the, the space so we can all participate. Everybody participate in the game. Okay, one minute. Let's check. Mm, here. Okay, so you're going to listen to the song and you have to tell me what's the name of the song or what's the, the singer or the group, whichever, okay? Okay, okay. Okay, okay. Oh, let's listen, let's listen. Uh -huh. Bruno, Mars. Bruno, Mars. Bruno Mars. And the name of the song, do you know? 
Ah, ah. Eh, aleluya, creo que dice el, el coro de la canción. What? Aleluya. Algo así. Chain smokers and the name of the of the song. No. Uh, closer, teacher. Closer. Closer. Yes. Okay. Let's see. Yes. Closer. Very good. Ah, uh, closer. Okay. Let's go. Another one. My room five. Maroon five. Years. My God, Love you're good, just... guys. You are good at this game. Uh -huh. See? Just... Girls like... Hola, teacher. Le escribí por chat privado de Zoom. Okay, but I'm, I'm doing this game. Wait. Okay, let's continue. Rihanna. Rihanna. Adriana. Oh my God, you're very good. Let's see, let's see. No, that's not, that's not. Yes, but with Calvin Harris. Rihanna. Oh. Riding on a horse. You can whip your horse. In English, guys. What, anybody? Horse. Horse. Old Town Road, hello? Old Town Road, yeah. Old Town Road, 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 Old Town Road. Teacher. Yes? Uh, yo sé que es un poco incómodo, pero eh, no podemos estar pasando videos así de YouTube con música porque... A la hora que lo subamos a YouTube, nos pueden penalizar el canal por el copyright. Mm -hmm. Yo sé okay. que es enseñanza y todo, pero eh, nos pueden bajar el video y nos pueden multar el, el canal. ¿Usted es? ¿Usted quién es? Mm -hmm. ¿Alumno es usted? Ok. No, yo soy Luis, inglés corporativo. Ok, y one no more and Sorry, guys, we cannot play games. Yeah. <laughs> eh, too bad. A Luis. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to be in my class, stopping my class all the time, Luis? Or should I teach? <laughs> okay, let's go then. We can have that. So we're fine for five seconds. Okay, now we're going to review um, what we saw yesterday, remember? Guys, yeah, let's direction. see directions. There is, there are. Remember? Yes, okay. yes, yes. Let's see, let's see. I have here, here. Okay. Let's see. Let's see this here. Okay. So. So there is and there are prepositions of place. Okay, let's see. Look at the mouse, okay? So complete okay. with in, on, under, or next to. Okay, let's see. Number one, the mouse is? In. Oh, in. Under. In. No, in, oh. in, is in. Inside, uh -huh. in inside the, the bag, in, in the Those box, is. in the bag. Okay, number two. Next to. Next, next, to. next to the bag. Very good. Three. 
three mm -hmm. on. The mouse is in front. On, on the floor. On the floor. On the floor. Look at the picture. On the floor. This is wow. in the bag, right? This is in the bag. Yeah. And this is on the floor. Number four. The mouse is on the chair. On, on the chair, right? On, on the chair. On, on the chair. chair. Yeah. And the mouse is under under the table. Under, under, the, table. Table. under, under the, table. the table. Very good. Under <laughs> the table. Okay, complete with there is, there are, and prepositions of place. Okay, let's see the first one. Who wants to try it? Herbert. Do the first one, please. Herbert? Uh, uh, give me a, a second, please. Okay. There. The... Yes. On the table. The but what? Beard. Beard. What? It's a bearded. Is it's a bearded cake? No, on the no, table. no, no. You have to use there is or there are. Uh, there is a bearded cake on the table. Very good. There is a birthday cake on the table. Uh, the next one, uh, Antonio. Hello? Yes. Um, what is the zanahoria? Carrots. Carrots. Mm -hmm. Carrots. Um, on three carrots. No, not paying attention, not paying attention. Uh, Jacqueline. Jacqueline. Jacqueline? Present teacher. Okay, can you answer that sentence, please? I can see the, the pantalla. No? No, teacher. Why? There are. Why, why no puede, ¿Por qué no puede ver la pantalla? Porque dice que inglés corporativo ha empezado la función de compartir, pero solo me aparece cargando, cargando. Dale y a un lado una y regresala. ¿Ah? Sálgase Dale. y vuelva a entrar. Ah, a bueno. al, porque todos lo están viendo. Lo, lo pueden ver todos. Yes, Tisha. Yes, yes. Okay. Yes. yes. Okay, uh, Norma, you want to answer? There are teacher. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Three carrots off the table. Why off? In. No, in Onde. is adentro. In. Onde. Onde. Uh -huh. Onde. Three carrots under the table. You see the, car the carrots are here. So there are three carrots sí. under the table, right? Under the table. Sí, sí. Oh, okay. Sorry. Um, let's see. Anna. Look at the picture. There's carrots. Uh, let's do um, on, on a cat. No, uh, you have to use uh, there no, is sir, and there sir. are. Uh -huh. um, there are cards on the on the table. Carrot, carrot. Ah, ah, sorry. Um, mm -hmm. a, a carrot. Uh, no. There is. is. Anybody there wants is, to help Anna, please? There is, there there is, is, carrot, there carrot. is a carrot in the, the in the cauliflower. No. Next to next to next, next, to, next, to, next the to the cauliflower. Next ah. to the cauliflower. Look cauliflower. at the drawing. Okay. Cauliflower. Look at the picture. Cauliflower. Yes, cauliflower. 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 Okay. 
Cauliflower. Eh, Gloria, the next cauliflower. one. There is a cat on the table. Yes, there is a cat yes. on the table. Very good. Uh, let's see if we have another. Wilson, the next one. Uh, there are five apples on the table. Very good. Mario. There are two bananas on the table. Very good. Uh, let's see, Steve. What, Steve? Steve Como Canales, fue? because you're Daniel, Steve. Steve Jerez is Daniel for me, and Steve Canales, you know. Okay, Steve? Steve? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> okay, um not here. Uh let's see. Saira. Yes, teacher. This one. Um, uh um this is a no, tortoise no. there is there there under the are. table there, there is, is or is there are a tortoise turtle like turtle yes turtle turtle, turtle. there is uh-huh a tortoise or turtle, turtle. Mm -hmm. uh under the table very good under, under the table, the table. Uh, let's see who else we get there. Christina. There is a mouse e on next. There is a mouse and the cat. No. Preposition. Next to next to the cat and the cake. Very good. There is a mouse next to the cat and the cake, right? Okay. And who wants to do the last one? Olinda? Hi, teacher. Okay, the last one. Uh, there is a candle. Candle. In the candle. Uh -huh. Next to cake? No, next to is this, like the carrot and the cauliflower. Next to. In the cake is, in, is inside. No, in, in the cake is inside. On the cake. It's a surface, right? On the cake. On the cake. On yes, the cake. on the cake, like the apples, the bananas, the mouse, right? The cat, okay? On, surface. In would be, we don't have anything in here. In, right? Turtle? We don't have, no, the turtle is under the under the table, next and to the carrot. The cake? No, on the cake. Okay, on the, the cake. candles are on the cake, inside. It's not inside the cake. Okay. Questions. No question. Teacher. Okay. Yes. Uh, uh, the previous sentence. Uh, we, we we see uh, between uh, yes. uh, between the, the cat mouse. Between the mouse. mouse. Uh -huh. Between the cat ah, and the cat. very good. Yes, we can say like we said before, and also we can say there is a mouse. Uh -huh. between, yes, between, between, the, cat between and the cat and the cake. And cake. Very good. Yes. Uh -huh. Yes. We can say between. Thanks. We can say between. Very good. Yes. Thanks. Any any other questions? Okay. Questions? Okay. So this is what we're going to do now. You are going to take a piece of paper out, a paper, right? A notebook paper. A paper, everybody, a paper. I'm going to dictate, okay? You're okay. going to listen and you're going to draw, right? To draw. You're going to listen and you're going to draw. Draw means what? What does it mean, draw? 
D R dibujar. Yes, dibujar. Uh -huh. Okay. You listen, I'm going to dictate, and you're going to draw. Okay. Okay. So tell me when, when you're ready. Tell me when you're ready. I'm ready. When everybody has a piece of paper? Yes, yes teacher. Okay. Yes. Because after you will show me your drawing, okay? You will show us our drawing. You'll share it. Okay, here we go. Um, there is a spider under the table. There is a spider under the table. There's a spider under the table. Okay. There is the next one. There Richard, is, Richard. yes. Quiere que dibujemos o que escribamos lo que dice? No, draw. 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 What does draw um, mean, guys? Dibujar. Yes. Okay. Okay, here we go. There is a spider under the table. Let's see how, how many of you are great artists. Okay, <laughs> under the table. There is a book. There is a spider under the table. It's the first one, yeah, okay. Mm-hmm. The next one is, there is a book on the table. There is a book on the table. On the table? Yes. Okay, thanks. The next one. There is a chair next to the table. There is a chair next to the table. Chair, repeat me, please. There is a chair. There is a cat. No, what did I say? There is a chair next chair to the table. Next to the table. Next one. There is a cat on the chair. There is a cat on the chair. On the chair. Chair. Teacher, repeat, there, there is a chair, please. Please follow because this is not I'm not going to, I repeat twice only. There is a chair next to the table. There is a Thank chair you. next to the table. There is a chair next to the table. There is, there is a cat on the chair. There is a right. cat on the on chair. The There's the cat on the chair. I'm not so good drawing. Doesn't matter. You try. <laughs> you try. Okay. Ready for the next one? I'm ready. Ready. There is a vase between a vase, you know where you put flowers, a vase? Ah, vase? There is a vase between the book and the um, and the album. Okay. There's an, 
Yeah. There is a vase, a vase where you put flowers, you know, a vase, a flower vase. There is a vase between the book. Remember that the book, where is the book? Libro. Where, libro. On the table, right? The book is on the table. So there is a vase between the book and the album, photographic album. Album <laughs> photographic. You have a translator there. <laughs> album, an album of, of pictures, of photos, a photo album. Next, ready? Ready. Ready, guys? I'm ready. On the table, there is a vase between the book and the album. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. uh, okay, okay. There's a vase between the book and the album, and the book is on the table, remember? The book is on the table. Okay. The okay next. There are three flowers in the vase. There are three flowers in the vase. There are three flowers in the vase. Ready? Ready. Ready. Okay, and the last one. There are a snake, snake, a snake, you know, and Mi vecina. <laughs> there are a snake, <laughs> a snake and a mouse. There are a snake and a mouse under the chair. There are a snake. There, there are a snake, a snake and a hamster under the chair. Hamster. Yes, uh, no, a, a mouse, I'm sorry, mouse. a hamster, a, hum, a mouse under the chair.
Let's see our great artists. <laughs> Okay, I will repeat everything. I'm going to repeat everything, okay? From the beginning. There is a spider under the table. Shh, spider. There is a spider under the table. There is a book on the table. There is a chair next to the table. There is a cat on the chair. There is a vase between the book and the album. There are three flowers in the vase. Three beautiful flowers. Could be red, yellow, green. There are a snake and a mouse under the chair. Mm -hmm. Let's see this fantastic, great artist I have. If you want to share, you can share. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Mario, what do you have? Let me see. I'm not so good at driving. Uh, well, 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 well. We all learn. Let's see. I, I draw many, many, many things. Many things. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Okay. Push. Can we see? Can we see? No, we cannot see because of the uh, your background. I think. No se ve por el por el uh -huh. background. Look for the there. background, uh -huh. Let's see. Oh, no se ve It's difficult to see it. Um, so so, or maybe you can, <laughs> you can, oh, you can take a picture and send it and send in WhatsApp. Take a picture. Okay. And send it to WhatsApp. Anybody else? Let's see how it looks. Somebody wants to share on a paper? Okay. Would... Yes, Let's see. Uh, difficult to see. Me, teacher. Uh huh. I see. Ah. Uh -huh. There is a spider under the table. Uh huh. There is a book on the table. Yes. Uh, 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 oh. A what? Three flowers. A what? Three flowers. What do we call that? What do we call that? I, I don't know how can I say florero. What what did I call guys? What is it? A vase. vase. It's, it's in the chat. Uh, a vase. A vase. There is a vase on the table. Mm -hmm. There is a vase between a book and a album. A album. Yes. Uh -huh. There, there is, there are three flowers inside of. Uh huh. In the vase. In the vase. Yeah. Uh -huh. There is a chair. Uh, Where's the chair? Next, next to table. Uh huh. And me, and there is a cat on the chair. <laughs> uh huh. And there under. Ah, and there is a snake and a mouse. And a mouse. Under the chair. Under the chair. Very good. Uh huh. Somebody else wants to share their drawing? Steve? Uh, more or less. Uh huh. Let's see. What do you have on the table? I see a spider. Uh, you have different tables, Steve. Yes. It was one table with everything in it. <laughs> so you have three tables in your room. <laughs> three tables in a spider. Uh, what else do you have? Ah, look at the chair. Where's the chair? Show me the sh chair. The chair. It, uh, it's ne not next to. Where's the chair? I don't see the chair. Ah, uh, next to. Yes, next to the table. 
what uh, in a cat in a vase with three flowers ah uh, the album and the yeah. and the book very book. nice very nice somebody else Maria did you take a picture take a picture guys and send it send it in WhatsApp let me I can put what's up here. And, and you can share it there. So we can all, you can share your pictures, guys. You take a picture and you share it in what's up. So we can see it. Uh huh. Saida, let me see your picture or your drawing. Oh, I have here pictures. Jacqueline. No, Jacqueline, something is wrong there with Jacqueline. Oh, here I have Steve. Daniel. Ah, oh, nice. Let me see if I can share it. Wait. No, wait. try. Let's see. I'm going to show you. I think I have here. This is Daniel. So you see it, guys? Yes. Daniel, can you describe what we see? My God. Uh huh. <laughs> Daniel? I'm sorry. Uh, Uncap, no art. I have okay, no share people. it, share it, share it. Okay. I mean, say it. What do you have? Uh, a spider on the table. On the table. On the table. On the, on the uh -huh. table. What else do we have there? A spider. Uh huh. What else? Que más? Uh, what else? Book on the table. Uh huh. Uh, what can they say, Florero? Guys, how do we say Florero again? Guys, how Base. do we say vase? Vase. Vase. There is a. There is a album. In the mm -hmm. middle, or how do we say in the middle? No, how do we say? How, uh, guys? How do we say it? Between, 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 between uh huh, and base, uh huh, um, notebook and book. Uh huh. And book. So there, there is an album, right? Between the base uh -huh. and the book, right? Right. Right. Okay, and what do we have? Uh, uh, chair. Uh -huh. We have a chair. Where is the chair? Uh, chair next to table. Next to the table. And what do we next have the on the chair? On the chair. What do we uh, have? My God, what, what is that? Uh, what do, guys, <laughs> what do we have on the chair? <laughs> What do we have on the chair? No. Guys? A ma no. What do we have on the uh, chair, guys? Uh, a mouse? Uh, a, a, a mouse? A snake. No. On the, on a the cat. chair. A on cat. A cat. A cat. A cat. A cat. Yes. A cat. And under the chair, we have a, a snake and chair, a mouse. Cat. Snake and a mouse. Snake and a mouse. Yes. Okay. Very good. Very good. Uh, My so God. Nice. Okay. Uh -huh. Let's see. Let's see somebody else. Oh, uh, <laughs> that's uh, Frank. You have a cat under. <laughs> you have a cat under the chair, Francisco. And this is Steve Canales. He described it. Ana Maria. Let, oh, let's see this one. This is David. Let's see. I want to see David's. David's. Okay, David, can you describe your your drawing? I did. David, can you? What do we have there? Um, there is a spider on their table. Is the spider under the table or on the table, under the, guys? Under the table. No, guys. On, under, on under the table. Tab on the table. Under the table. On the table. Uh, okay. What do we have on the table? 
What do we have on the table? On the, on the table. No, what do we have on the table? On. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Spider. Telarañas. No, no, no. Describe your picture, David. Uh, what do, what book, do we have on, here? Book base. Uh, there, on, no, on there the, is, there is. There is, there is a book on the table. Uh -huh. uh, there is base on the table. There is a base on the table. Uh, uh, there is a red platform. A what? Uh, el Mouse. Del... Here. Fotografía como retrato. Album. 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 There is an album. Uh, an album. There is an album. An album. An album uh -huh. on the table. And the base, where is? Base between. Uh huh. There is between. between. Uh huh. Or. No, the, the between. Between. Uh huh. Uh, on the book. No. There is a base between. Between. On the book? No. One preposition, David. One. There is a vase. Guys, help him. There is a vase. Where is the vase, guys? Between. Between. Um, between. A book. The book. And the book. Uh, album. Very good. Between the book. And, an, and the album, right? There is a base between you, you. You can only use one preposition, David, not two. You cannot say the between and on, right? There is a base between the book and well, the album. Yes, and, yeah. Okay. And what is this? What is this? Where is this? Uh, there is shape. No, here. Okay, there is uh, a chair. Don't forget the articles. Don't forget the articles. There, there, there is a chair. Uh huh. Where is the chair? Next uh, table. Next to. Next to table. Next to the table. Uh, there is a cat on the chair. Uh huh. And these things. Uh, there are snakes on the chair. There, uh, there are a snake and a mouse under the table, under the chair. Under right? the chair. Okay, uh, very good. That's it, I think. Right? Very good. Okay. Let's see if we have other ones. Uh, can we see? Uh, it's Francisco's. Uh, this is Christina. Can you see Christina? Christina? Ella sí puede dibujar. That's a nice one. Christina, can you see it? Yes, teacher. Uh -huh. But the, the spider is not under the table. Where's the spider? It's not on the table. Guys? Under, under the table. No, um, under. 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 Yes, under the under. table. Very good. The spider is under the table. You are right, David. It's under the table. Okay, so we have this. What do we have here? The, what is this? The base uh, uh, between. There is a base between a book and the album. Very good. And we have, what do we have here? There, there are three flowers. Where? In the base. In the base. Very good. 
And she has her cat. Very nice. Where's the cat? Uh, there is a cat on the chair. Uh huh. And and, the, and there is a mouse under the chair. Uh -huh, and a... there is a snake under the chair. Uh, and where's the chair? Where's the chair? And there a chair next to on the table. No, no next, next to, to the table. The table next to Where? the table. Okay, very good. Mm -hmm. So we have many here. Let's see if we find another one that we can. Uh, oh, here you go, Mister. Uh huh, Mario. We can see yours, <laughs> Mario. <laughs> Uh, I it's good. No, no, it's good. <laughs> Incluso Mario puede dibujar mejor que yo. Oh, no, but it's good. You see, you have the snake and uh, this little, little, little spider there. <laughs> and where, where is the mouse? Where's the mouse? The mouse to the snake. The mouse is? It's under. Under the and table. Ne oh, next to the snake. Next, next to the snake. Very good. And you can say that the snake is what? It's under the table and uh, next to the spider. Or between the spider and the mouse, yeah. right? Yeah. Very good. Wow. Great <laughs> artist I have in this class. <laughs> Ah, but well, look at this is who's this is Jose Santo, right? Jose, is that yours? Jose, no, nothing, no. nothing on your table, only a book. <laughs> okay, very good. <laughs> okay, so we're going to do another dictation. Okay, another dictation. One minute, I have it here. Where is it? my other dictation? Let's see if I have it here. No, no no okay. <laughs> Not here. Okay. There's another dictation. You're going to listen carefully. Okay? Listen. I'm not going to do the dictation. Somebody else. Somebody else. Okay? Okay, so listen carefully. You ready? Now, this time, you don't have to draw. This time, you will you will listen and write. Okay? Write, okay. Yes, you will write. You won't listen. You will write. Okay, here we go. Ready? Go. Ready. I'm ready. Okay, I'm gonna start. This is Mr. Bean. You know Mr. Bean, guys? Yes, yes. The famous Mr. Bean, Mr. Frijol, we would say, yes. right? Like in, in, in It's Spanish. an actor from United Kingdom. Yeah. So, uh, he, British. yeah, British actor. British actor. So this is Mr. Bean, uh, Mr. Bean working day. Okay, so he's going to, they're going to describe Mr. Bean's working day. Okay, here we go. You have to copy that, I mean, uh, write it. Teacher, no he entendido bien lo que vamos a hacer. Write. Listen. Listen and write. What do you hear? Write what do you hear. Okay? Tienes que escuchar y escribir lo que oye. Okay? Okay. Okay, I'm going to repeat. This is Mr. Bean. Mm 
Tell me if you want me to repeat. I repeat one more time. I'm going to repeat three times. Okay. Ready? Ready. 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 I'm ready. Teacher. Okay, copy that. Yes? Teacher, I, I no listen. Guys, you cannot hear? No, teacher. No, no teacher. No, 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 teacher. I'm waiting. Uh, oh, really? You can hear? Oh, wait. And then I have to share one minute. Come on, it. I thought you were hearing. Okay. One minute. Yes, okay. Here we go again. Mr. Bean works at a school near his house. He's there from nine o'clock to four o'clock, Monday to Friday. Teacher, again, please. I'm only going to play it three times, okay? This part. Here we go, second time. Mr. Bean works at a school near his house. He's there from nine o'clock to four o'clock, Monday to Friday. One more time. Okay. He usually gets... Mr. Bean works at a school near his house. He's there from 9 o'clock to 4 o'clock, Monday to Friday. Tell me when you're ready. I don't get it. What do you mean? What do you mean? You just heard that Mr. Bean walks at the school from his house. No, it's working day. It's a working day. Mr. Bean works at a school near his house. He's there from 9 o'clock to 4 o'clock, Monday to Friday. We're talking about his work. Mm -hmm. His work near his house. Mm -hmm. Copy. You have to write it down. <clears throat> Ready for the next part? Mm, no, teacher. Mr. Bean works at a school near his house. He's there from 9 o'clock to 4 o'clock, Monday to Friday.
-hmm. Continue. Guys? Yes. yes Con yes. Okay. He usually gets home from school at about 4.30. You should get a. He usually gets home from school at about four thirty. He usually gets home from school at about four thirty. O'clock, Monday to Friday. He usually gets home from school at about four thirty. And five thirty. To Friday. He usually gets home from school at about 4.30. Mm -hmm. How are we doing? So, so? So, so. He usually gets home from school at about for study. Very good. Pay attention, pay attention. And has a snack. It's about 4.30. And has a snack. And has a snack. And has a snack. And has a snack. Snack is like a, you know, like a merienda, a snack. And has a snack. Hmm? What? Like a bocadillo? Yeah, snack. like a merienda, snack. A merienda. merienda. Merienda, snack. And has a snack. Ready for the next part? Yes. In the afternoon, he goes for a walk with his dog. In the afternoon, at about 4.30, and has a snack. In the afternoon, he goes for a walk with his dog. Um, understand. No? E... Pronunciation. Yes, but you, yes, you have to learn to listen. You have to listen to different accents, right? It's a British accent. Yes, it's kind of British, but you have to learn to listen, right? Yes. Okay. Mr. Bean teaches English. And Mr. Bean what? Teaches English. Teaches English, right? Mr. Bean teaches English. Mr. Bean teaches English. He's a very good teacher. What is that? It's a very he, good teacher. He is a yes, very, he is. He, he's a very good he teacher. A very good teacher. He's a very good teacher. That's it. Okay, we'll repeat everything. Okay, here we go. Okay. This is slower. Mr. Bean... Works, works at a school, at school. near his house. Full stop. He's there. He's there. He's there. From nine o'clock. To four o'clock. From nine o'clock to four o'clock. Comma. Comma. There's a comma. Monday. Monday. To Friday. Full stop. Full stop means that there's a period there. He usually. 
He usually gets home from school at about four thirty and has a snack. Full stop. In the afternoon, he goes for a walk with his dog. Full stop. Mr. Bean. Teaches English and he's a very good teacher. Full stop. Full stop means there's a period there. Okay, let's see. Okay, uh, the first sentence. Who wants to read the first sentence? Mm -hmm. Who wants to read the first sentence? Yes? Norma. Or what do we have? Uh, Steve or Anna, you want to read the first sentence? Mr. Bean, what? Uh, okay, the, the famous Mr. Bean working day. Okay, first sentence. Okay, uh, Mr. Bean works at the school near house and there near house. his house near uh, his near house, house, house. Near okay his house remember uh, his is possessive right his house period mario number two sentence number two he's there from nine night to nine o'clock to four o'clock monday to friday very good the third sentence gloria No sé si es este, pero he usually gets 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 house from home. No, gets house. No, gets home. Ah, gets home. Ajá. Era trabajo. No, home. He gets home. He usually gets home. Casa, hogar. Home. Uh, home mm -hmm. from school. Uh huh. Uh, uh, what else? What else? Uh, um, no. Daniel, continue with uh, the sentence. Um, at. Yes. At. Daniel. At. Mm -hmm. Go to phone uh, about for it. At about. At about. Uh huh. At about. See, uh, Daniel. At, at about. For it, no. I snack in the afternoon. No. At about. What at time? About. What time? Four thirty. Four thirty. Four thirty. Four thirty. And. And he yeah. has a, a snack. And he has a snack. And he has a snack. Francisco, the next sentence. Francisco? Uh, Wilson. Aquí estoy, pero no veo. Es que no tiene in que ver. Fue un dictado. Okay, Wilson, in the afternoon. In the afternoon. Mm -hmm. He goes for what? For what? We can stop. Okay. With his dog. Very good. Era un dictado, Francisco. Tenía que apuntar. 
And number, the last one, Anna. Mr. Bean speak English. No, teaches, teaches. Teaches. Uh, teaches. teaches. English. English, and he is a very good teacher for stop. Very good. Yeah, full stop means period. Very good. Let me show you. Let me show you. Here you go. Okay. These are, this is the dictation. Okay. So we're going to have once a week, we're going, uh, once a week, we finish. <laughs> <laughs> uh, tomorrow and uh, Monday, we're going to have dictations. It's good to listen and write, right? Um, so here, Mr. Bean works because this is Mr. Bean, Mr. Bean's possessive. Yes. This is possessive. Working, Working yes. day, right? So Mr. Bean works at a school near his house. His house. He is, this is he is, he's there from nine o'clock to four o'clock, comma, Monday to Friday, period. He usually gets home from school at about 4.30 and has a snack. In the afternoon, he goes for a walk with his dog. Mr. Bean teaches English and he is, he is, he is a very good teacher. Yes? Yes. Okay, so here you could have uh, different dictations, but anyway. Okay, so that, that was the dictation. Okay, so you have to really, I know that it's a different accent, it's a British accent, but it's good to listen to different accents. Yes. Okay? Okay. Uh, so we're going with the dictation and now we're going to go to adjectives. Okay, adjectives. I'm going to learn a little bit about adjectives. Do I have adjectives? Yeah. No. Okay. Adjectives. What do adjectives do? What do they do? adjectives. The adjectives are always before a noun, right? And what do adjectives do? What do they do? Guys, ¿qué hacen los adjetivos? What do they do? Guys, what do they do, the adjectives? Describe. Uh, describe. Describe the nouns, right? The noun. Describe okay. nouns. Adjectives, word order. A Woodward English grammar lesson. An adjective is a word that describes something, a noun. An adjective gives us more information about a person or thing. Adjectives sometimes appear after the verb to be. The order is to be plus adjective. He is tall. She is... Okay, so sometimes the adjective describes something. Okay, or gives us more information. So here we have, this is... a. Uh, uh, and af the verb sometimes appears after the verb to be, okay? For example, he is tall, she is happy, he is intelligent, 
He is smart. He is short. Okay. So is the telling describing us the person, right? Like he is or she is. Happy. Adjectives sometimes appear before a noun. The order is adjective plus noun. Slow car. Brown hat. Okay. So these are this is the two ways, two formats. After the verb to be, right? He is, she is, uh, and or before the noun. Okay, I have a slow car, he has a brown hat. Yes? Okay, so these are the two structures. But sometimes you want to use more than one adjective to describe something or someone. Here is a hat. What happens if the hat is both brown and old? What does it mean, old, guys? Yeah. What is old? Yeah. Okay. Is both brown and old. Do we say an old brown hat or a brown old hat? Which is correct? Which is correct, guys? No? Old brown hat. Yes, old brown hat. The age and then the color. Or brown old hat. An old brown hat is correct because a certain order for adjectives is expected. A brown old hat sounds incorrect or not natural. So what is the correct order of adjectives before a noun in English? The order of adjectives before a noun is usually the following. Opinion, size, age, shape, color, origin, material, purpose. Okay, these, in, if you have more than two adjectives, this is the order, right? My opinion, like beautiful, ugly. Uh, this is your opinion. Size, small, right? A big age is old, new, shape, triangle, circular, round, the color, origin, Italian, Japanese, material. Uh, plastic, uh, leather, wooden, and the purpose. Why we use this noun? Uh, we use it for tourism, for sports, okay? So this, if you have more than two adjectives, this is the order. If we take the first letter of each one, it creates... Oses comp. So you can memorize it like this. Oses comp. Oses comp. Which is an easy way to remember the order. Let's look at this example. We are describing a bag. It is an ugly, small, old, thin, red Italian cotton sleeping bag. Okay. If we have more than one adjective, because we can say, oh, it is a, a cotton sleeping bag, you can say, or it is an ugly sleeping bag. I can say that, right? But there is an order. I cannot say, yo no puedo decir, uh, it is, all this uh, small red bag. No, there is an order. Okay, so so it, that it sounds well, right? That it sounds good when you it speak. It's not common to have so many adjectives before a noun. But I do this so you can see the correct order of adjectives. 
ugly is an opinion. Small is a size. Old refers to age. Thin refers to shape. Red is a color. Italian refers to its origin. Cotton refers to the material the bag is made of. Sleeping is the purpose of the bag. Okay, what is cotton? What is cotton? Algodon. Yeah. And sleeping bag, you know what a sleeping bag is? Guys? Una bolsa para dormir. Yeah. But the one you go camping, you know, the one you go yeah. camping, when you go camping, acampar, you have a sleeping bag, right? Yes. It's a sleeping bag. And it's made of cotton, and it's Italian, it's red, it's thin. What is thin? Delgado. Delgado. Old, small, and ugly. That's my opinion. It's ugly, right? I will go into more details about each of these categories in a moment. First, let's see two more examples. A beautiful long white French silk wedding dress. Okay, this is another example. Beautiful is my opinion. Here I don't have this, so I have long. What is long? Guys, long. Largo. 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 White, French, silk. What is silk? Seda. Seda. Wedding is the wedding, right? It's a wedding dress. Large, ancient. That's a wedding dress. That's the purpose. Para casamiento. Wedding dress. Yeah. Okay. And here I have a vase. Remember the vase? What is a vase we said? Florero. Florero. Vases is plural. So we have a large... Agent, agent, agent means uh, old, very, very old, antique, right? An ancient, large, is large, not long, large. Greek, clay, what is clay? Clay? What is clay? Arcilla. Yeah, like arcilla. Flower vases. Flower. That's the purpose arcilla because it's a barro. flower. Barro. Uh -huh, like barro. Okay. So you have to remember this is the order. O S A, right? Osas. Osas. You can remember that. Okay. Comp. Comp. So you can remember the order. Of adjectives. Let's see what else we have here. Mm -hmm. When we're talking about opinion, uh, but this is guy, but use it. Opinion is like your observation or your attitude. Right? For example, if I say it's delicious, for me, delicious. Repeat, delicious. 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 Delicious is delicious. delicioso, right? Delicious. Like, lovely delicious. is lovely is like... Uh, Amal? No, Amal? but it's like... Uh, no, lovely is nice, but it's lovely. I don't know how to say it. You know, this, that song, isn't she lovely? Yeah, like Amoros could be. Lovely, lovely. Repeat, lovely. 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 Nice, lovely. nice. 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 Cool. Nice. Cool. 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 cool and pretty. Pretty. Pretty is like beautiful. It's the same thing, right? And cool. Like a pretty woman. Yeah, pretty woman. Like cool, mm -hmm. cool, right? So these yeah. are my opinions. My opinions. Because I can say that's a delicious soup, but maybe you don't like it and you're going to say, Ugh, right? It's, I don't like it. It's not delicious, right? So, but this is your opinion and this goes first, right? And that goes first. Let me see what else they explain there. 
Comfortable is an opinion. Comfortable. Repeat. Comfortable. 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 Okay, so comfortable armchair. This is an armchair. You see here? Armchair. Armchair. So it's a comfortable green armchair. Right? Green armchair. Um, then we have, let's see another you know, example. This is the size, big, small, tall, okay? Tall. What is the opposite of tall? Short. 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 Very good. Huge is very big. Very big is huge. Huge. Repeat. Huge. 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 Tiny, 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 petit, tiny. Petit, 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 or tell us how large. Right? Yeah. Like when you when you buy a sweater, is large, right? The size, small or medium, right? Or medium. When you buy a shirt or yeah, sweater or whatever. Okay, so this is size. Uh, so here we have, right? Size, the big fat is the shape. Okay, fat is the shape. Fat, like look at the animal, fat. A big, right? a big fat red monster. Okay, so this is the shape. It could be thin, Delgado, long, largo, could be round, triangular, right? So these are shapes. Oops. And what else do we have? H, we can say old, young, repeat young, 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 young new. Young. New, 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 and antique, antique, antique. Ancient. ancient, 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 ancient. Okay, ancient. so this is this is the age, the age of uh, whatever we are describing. A scary. That's my opinion. Scary. What is scary? Miedoso, tenebroso. Scary. Old house, right? Scary old house. So that's the shape. It's round, square, square, long, fat, and heavy. Heavy, pesado, right? Heavy. Heavy is like fat. Okay, we can say fat or heavy. And that's a small, that's the size, round, Table. table, small round table. Uh, then we have the colors: green, blue, reddish. It's ro rojo, reddish, purple. What is purple? Purple. Morado. Morado. Purpura. And pink. Pink. Rosado. Right. So that's a long. Yellow dress, long yellow dress. And origins, American, British, Indian, Turkish, Moroccan, Argentinian, French, whatever. That's the origin. An ancient, ancient or old Egyptian boy. Okay, we're describing the boy. And the material, we have gold, wooden, repeat, wooden, wooden. de madera. When something is de madera, we say wooden, 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 wooden. wooden. Plastic. Wooden. Plastic. plastic, plastic, or synthetic, synthetic, synthetic. synthetic. Okay, so this is a beautiful, my opinion, pearl, what is pearl? Wow. 
Perlas. Perlas, the material. Necklace. This is a necklace. Repeat. Necklace. 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 And then we, what, what do we use it for? Uh, for gardening. What is gardening? What is gardening? What is gardening? Gardineria. Shopping. Shopping. And writing. Writing. Right. Writing. Okay. So these are all, uh, for example, Messi. No Messi el jugador. Messi, Messi. desordenado. Messi. Messi. Well, they're desordenado también. Messi. <laughs> computer. Desk. Right? The purpose is why we use the desk. ¿Por qué lo ocupamos el desk? For computer, right? For the computer. Oh, okay. And messy is because look at the room, right? So it's messy. And what else do we have? That's it. So this is, let's see if I can copy this and I copy it in a WhatsApp. Let's see. Okay, I shared it in WhatsApp, the picture, okay? The picture that I have now there, I shared it in WhatsApp. So the picture I shared it in uh, in WhatsApp so you can have it, right? And so this is what we just and they give you some examples here, right? So before adjectives plus a noun, we have to use this, right? We have to use a or an or the or my book, my beautiful book, right? A beautiful book. We have to use these determiners or what we call them, determinantes. A, an, the, my, your, possessive, right? Her, for, if I say four beautiful books, this beautiful vase, those beautiful vases, right? Some beautiful vase or something like that. So here is the determiner. You have to use it before the adjective and the noun, okay? For example, Rosa Hilda, you want to read the example? A wonderful... wonderful. Uh, Cristina, you want to read? A wonderful... A wonderful large round Spanish marble table. Very good. So ah, uh, so we use we have to use one of these. Wonderful is my opinion. Large is size. Round is shape. Origin is Spanish. Marble is the material and table. So I'm describing the table. A wonderful large round Spanish marble table. We don't need commas. No necesitamos comas in a, like this. My brown, my, you see, I need it here. My brown leather. What is leather? Cuero. 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 Leather. Cuero. Riding, riding boots. Botas de, para... Bota de cuero. Uh -huh. Botas de cuero to go in, a, in a, a caballo. Riding boots. All right. De, da, little. The little, pequeño, old man. Okay, so you have to use these when you are writing sentences, right? And these are some other samples. Okay, told you that. Okay, questions. So I copy this in WhatsApp so you can have it, okay? It's important that you know the order. 
we don't, no usamos muchos adjetivos, a veces solo dos, right? But even if you use do, two, aunque ustedes solo usen dos, es necesario que sepan la or, el orden, right? The order in an adjective, the adjective order. Okay, let's see if we can do a uh, practice exercise. Okay, let's see. Which is the correct order? You tell me, guys. Which is the correct order? A big green ball. A big green ball. No. A big green ball. Yes, a big is the size, green is the color. Yes? Yes. Yes. No. yes. 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 Correct. Okay, next. A long blue a long train. Main train. Blue. blue. A long blue train. train. Blue. No, train is the noun. Okay, a, so long a long blue, blue train. A long blue train. train. Very good. Ne next. A an ugly purple an monster. Ugly purple monster. Yes. A beautiful, beautiful pink dog. A new blue skateboard. Everybody agree? A new blue, because new is age. Uh -huh. Blue skateboard. Very good. Next. An old orange bike. Very good. Santos, do the next one. Jose Santos. Olinda. Um, a black short right? Yeah, what's the answer? A short time black. A short black train. Olinda, a short black train, is that correct? Yes, teacher. Very good. Next, Anna. Boy, boy, boy. A yellow, beautiful cake? No. Beautiful is my opinion. So what would I say? A beautiful yellow cake? Kite. A beautiful yellow kite. Yellow kite. Kite, kite is for... Kite is uh, piscucha. Oh, okay. Uh, I, uh, let me see. Iris. David. Or, or Iris. Steve. Oh, blue what? A blue, a what? An old blue boat. An old blue boat. Very good, David. Next, uh, Iris. Uh, Norma? A small red car. Norma? Norma? Did you answer Norma? Was it Norma or Iris? La segunda, teacher. Okay, Who, who's speaking? Norma or Iris? Iris. Who wants? Okay, Iris, what do you say? A small... Red car, good. Yes. Uh, very good. David? 
Uh, go kart or black? No, go kart is the no. noun. Oh. Black. And old, yeah. and old go black go kart. An old black go kart. Very good. Uh, Jacqueline? Jacqueline? Um, Wilson? Uh, an ugly orange doll. An ugly orange doll. Very good. Uh, Herbert? Herbert? Daniel? Okay. Uh, a, a fat yellow car. Very good. Um, edit. Hola. Mm -hmm. uh, a bit black. Mm -hmm. A big black? A big black what? Very good. Uh, Rosa Hilda. Okay. Um, ugly purple kite. Very good. Christina. Uh, A uh, new pink, pink ball. Bo Very good. Saira. Okay, teacher. Uh, green big monster. A green big monster. monster. Are you sure? A green monster. No. A big green monster. A, a, big, green a big green monster. That's the oh, right yes. one. Uh, let's see. Some Pat Patricia, no? Patricia? Uh, Gabriela? Mm. Mario? Your microphone. A small white plane. A small white plane. Uh, Jacqueline, I'll try again. Yes, teacher. Uh -huh. What's the answer? A new bike red. Bike is a noun. Yes, uh, uh, a new. The last one, did you? Bike. No, bike is a noun. A bike red new. Bike is a noun. Adjectives go before the noun. A new red bike. A new red bike. New red bike. Very good, a new red yeah. bike. Oh, thank mm -hmm. you. Adjectives go before the noun. Anna, try. Uh, a small brown shop. Very good. 
Okay, questions? 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 No, no, no teacher. No teacher. No teacher. Um, let's see. Yeah, have another one here. Quickly, the, you have to tell me the adjectives. Look at the face. What is it? What is it? Guys? Happy. 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 No. Uh-huh. Hungry. 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 Surprise. Surprise. Sad. 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 <laughs> That's it. Ooh, very <laughs> short. Okay. Um, okay, here we have um, Describe how my and others working places or areas look like, okay? And here, this is the description of Mr. Paz and Mrs. Aguilar's uh, workplaces. Okay, so let's see what Mr. Paz, this is how he described the place where he works. You wanna read, Gloria? There is... There is a beautiful... Lobby. Mm -hmm. There are comfortable rooms. Comfortable. 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 Mm -hmm. Rooms. There is a. How do we say this word, guys? How do we say that? A huge. huge. A huge. A huge, huge uh -huh. parking lot. And? There are three kids. High. Height. Tech. Tech. Elevators. 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 Ele elevators. Elevators. So where does he work? Where does he work? Is there... Where lobby. does he work? Where does he work? In a big company, maybe. No, there is a lobby. There are rooms. In there's hotel. a hotel. In a hotel. hotel. Very good. He works in a hotel, right? In a hotel. So you see here we have the adjectives and he's describing his workplace. There's a beautiful lobby, comfortable rooms, an enormous parking lot. And there are three high-tech elevators. Okay, let's see uh, Mrs. Aguilar. This is Mrs. Aguilar. Jacqueline, you want to read? Yes. Uh, there is a narrow reception area. There are two dirty dining rooms. There is an ugly photocopy center. There are small offices. Where does she work? My God. There is a narrow. Narrow means this. Narrow. This is wide and this is narrow. What would it be narrow? What does it mean narrow? Angost. Uh -huh. Narrow and the opposite is wide. Narrow and wide. So they're narrow reception area. They're too dirty. What does it mean dirty? Sucios? Sucio. Yes, sucios. Sucio. Dining room. And the opposite of dirty? Clean. 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 Mm. There is an ugly photocopy center. And there are small offices. Where does she work? Receptionist. Receptionist. Yeah, but where? To the um. dirty dining rooms. An ugly photocopy center, and there are some maybe in a school, <laughs> maybe in a school. 
What do you think? Where does she work? In a school? How does how does Mr. Paz describe his workplace? He said it's beautiful, right? Beautiful, comfortable, huge, three high-tech elevators. And me and Mrs. Aguilar. What does Mrs. Aguilar think about her workplace? It's horrible, narrow, dirty, ugly, small. She doesn't like the place where she works, right? In, in which place would you like to work? You guys, in which place would you like to work? This one or this one? The wow. first one. Uh-huh, Mr. Paz, right? I don't want to work in the two dirty rooms. So we use adjectives to describe, like we saw places, right? Or things, or people sometimes. And here are, there are comfortable rooms. There is a huge parking lot. There are nice places to rest, para descansar, to rest, nice places to rest, and there is an illuminated, what does it mean? Illuminated, repeat, illuminated, illuminated. illuminated. training room, training room. So this is like a gym, right? Like a sports center, because there's a training room, para entrenar, right? Illuminated training room, nice, nice places para descansar, to rest, a huge parking lot, and comfortable rooms. These are positive adjectives. And negative adjectives, you want to read, uh, Mario, what does it say in negative adjectives? Excuse me? Read the, the negative adjectives. Read the sentences. There is a narrow reception area. There are small offices. Office. There is a disgusting, disgusting kitchen area. There is a smiley living room. Okay, so these are negative adjectives. There are narrow reception area, small offices, disgusting. Repeat, disgusting. 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 Disgusting is like saying wakala, wakala, right? Yes. Wak wakala kitchen area. And smelly, smelly yeah. living room. Yeah. We don't want we don't want to work there. We want to work here. Comfortable, huge parking lot, nice places to rest. Uh, uh, delicious food cafeteria, illuminated training room. Okay. Now, uh, complete the sentence using the word provided in the correct verb. Small and gym. Uh huh. Give me a sentence using small and gym. Uh, Daniel. Mm -hmm. There is a small gym. Very good. Number two, uh, David. There is a training room. There are. There are. Very good because there there's rooms. There are new training rooms. Steve Canales. Yes. Uh -huh. There are um, there are uh, clean cafe cafeterias. Cafeterias, cafeterias, cafeterias. Cafeteria. Cafeteria. Mm -hmm. Cristina. There is a smart meeting room. Very good. Number five, let's see, Wilson. There are unpleasant bathroom. bathroom. Um, bathrooms. And Francisco, the last one. Um, 
edit. Then there is uh -huh. any cubic. There is a tiny, a tiny, a tiny. cubicle, cubicle. What is cubicle? Cubicle. Yes, it's, it's, it's where, where you work, right? You, some people have cubicles. They don't have offices, right? You have cubicles. Uh, okay. Questions? Questions? No, teacher. Okay. So any questions about your homework tomorrow? About your homework tomorrow, I think I have it. No, it's not here. Remember that you have to write uh, for your presentation, Please right? Write sentences about the places around. Use prepositions of place to describe their location, right? right. You have to say, I work at, for example, Bandesal, right? In the first sentence. Bandesal is next to, na, 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 right? Um, uh, what else? It's, uh, yes. Uh -huh, yes. Alameda. Alameda. No. Just say Alameda. Some words are generic, son genéricos, no se pueden traducir. Ah, okay. Okay. Okay, so here you have to write sentences and you have to read them to the class. You have to say, I work at Bandasal. Bandasal eh, is on uh, whatever street, Calle La Mapola. Read. It's next to a church. Near Bandasal, there is a, a park, right? Uh, we have, uh, there, is, there are many cafeterias. There are two restaurants, okay, like this. Using prepositions of place, in, on, at, okay, or the other prepositions. Okay, here you describe. And you can have, you can make like a little pictures. You can have a picture of a church or park and maybe a copy of, picture of Bandesal, you know, just have the whatever, right? And you start describing using adjectives, prepositions, and there is and there are. Prepositions of place, there is, there are, right? It's next to, it's near, and you can say it's a beautiful building, it's comfortable offices, huge parking lot, okay? So that's for tomorrow. Questions, preguntas. Preguntas. Sí, teacher. Ajá. Dígame. Vaya, eso lo vamos a presentar, eh, por ejemplo, en PowerPoint y vamos a compartir la pantalla o solo. Sí, lo vamos sí, a puede tener. Sí. No, puede poner un, un, un PowerPoint, pero solo una. How do you say that? A slide, right? Solo una diapositiva, I think it's called. Diapositiva. Ok, puede tener una o dos diapositivas nada más, right? Ok. And, and remember that you have to use there is, there are, prepositions of place, and you can use some adjectives. The adjectives we just learned. Positive adjectives, right? Not negative adjectives. Some adjectives you can use to describe the place you work, right? Questions? Any other questions? Otras preguntas? No, teacher. No? Okay. I'm going to take attendance. Let's see. One minute. Okay. 
Okay, Ana Maria Campos. Present teacher. Remember guys that you have to um, complete, completar sus deberes y sus exámenes by Friday, okay? By Friday. Friday is the last day. Ana Maria Campos is here. Uh, oops. Yeah, Ana Maria Campos, Cristina. Present. Dan Daniel. Present teacher. E Edith. Edith. Present. Adelia. Present. Uh, Francisco. Present teacher. Gabriela. Gabriela. Gloria. Herbert. Present. Herbert. Good evening, teacher. Present. Present. Uh, Iris. Iris. Present. Uh, Present. Ja Jacqueline. Present, teacher. Jose. Present, teacher. Mm -hmm. Never participate. <laughs> <laughs> Luis, 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 presentation, present, Marco, Mario, present teacher, Norma, Norma, present teacher, present, Olin, present, Olin, Olinda, present teacher, Patricia, Rosailda, present teacher. Silvia, David, present teacher, Wilson, and Saya. Present teacher. Okay, any questions for tomorrow? Remember, there is, there are adjectives and prepositions of place for tomorrow. You can have a slide, right? If we don't, we only do half tomorrow and on Monday we do the other half students. I will decide tomorrow which ones. Voy a decidir mañana quiénes van a pasar. Okay? Okay. But okay. so be, be ready. Jose va a tener que hablar y encender la cámara por una vez. And the rest of you. When you give your presentation, you have to encender la cámara. Okay? Okay. 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 So that's for tomorrow. Okay. See you tomorrow. Okay. Bye. See you tomorrow. Bye. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Bye. Good night, teacher. Good night. Good night.